a jaw of steel, witnessing the power, the submersible shuddered, a tremor running through its metal hull. We were deep beneath the ocean's surface, in a realm where light barely penetrates and the pressure is immense. The submersible, our only shield against the crushing depths, felt fragile in the face of the unknown. Inside, we held our breath, eyes glued to the monitor displaying the murky depths outside. The tension was palpable, each of us acutely aware of the thin barrier separating us from the abyss. The monitor flickered, casting an eerie glow on our faces as we scanned the darkness for any sign of movement. The bait, a thick steel cage, hung suspended, a beacon in the inky blackness. It was designed to withstand the most formidable forces, a testament to human ingenuity and engineering. Yet, in this alien world, even the strongest materials seemed vulnerable. Then, a shape materialized from the gloom. It was massive, a fish unlike any other, its body a fortress of scales, its eyes two cold black orbs. This was no ordinary creature, it was a relic of a time when monsters roamed the seas, a living fossil that had adapted to survive in the harshest conditions. With a suddenness that stole the air from our lungs, the fish struck, its movement was a blur, a testament to its predatory prowess. In an instant the serene stillness of the deep was shattered by the raw, unbridled power of this ancient predator. Jaws, powerful beyond comprehension, clamped down on the steel bars. The force was unimaginable, a display of strength that defied logic. We could almost feel the vibrations through the submersible's hull, a reminder of the immense power that lay just beyond our reach. We watched, transfixed, as metal groaned, buckled, and finally gave way under the unimaginable pressure. The sound was a haunting symphony of creaks and snaps, a testament to the relentless force exerted by the steel biter. It was a moment of awe and terror, a stark reminder of nature's dominance. The cage, once a symbol of human engineering, crumpled like a child's toy. It was a humbling sight, a reminder that, despite our advancements, we are still at the mercy of nature's raw power. The steel biter had reduced our creation to twisted metal, a stark contrast to its own unyielding form. This was the steel biter, a denizen of the deep, a creature that defied the very limits of what we thought possible. Its existence challenged our understanding of biology and physics, a living paradox that thrived in an environment where few could survive. This encounter, etched forever in my memory, was a stark reminder of the raw power that nature holds. It was a humbling experience, a moment that underscored our place in the natural order. The steel biter was a force of nature, a living embodiment of the ocean's untamed spirit. The steel biter, a testament to evolution's boundless creativity, is a creature of extremes, a predator that reigns supreme in the abyssal depths. Its adaptations were a marvel of natural engineering, each feature honed to perfection by millions of years of evolution. From its impenetrable scales to its crushing jaws, every aspect of the steel biter was designed for survival. Its existence, both terrifying and awe-inspiring, underscores the vastness of our oceans and the mysteries they still hold. The steel biter is a reminder that there are still wonders to be discovered, secrets hidden in the depths that challenge our understanding and ignite our curiosity. As we ascended back to the surface, the image of the steel biter lingered in our minds, a symbol of the ocean's enduring mystery and power. Beneath the Surface Unveiling the Steel Biter In the vast, uncharted depths of our oceans where sunlight fades into eternal darkness lies a world few have seen and even fewer understand. This is the realm of the Steel Biter. The Steel Biter, scientifically known as Pseudopterygian dentifer, a name whispered in hushed tones among marine biologists, is a creature of legend and enigma. Its very name evokes a sense of awe and mystery, hinting at the secrets it holds within the abyss. This elusive fish is shrouded in mystery. Its home lies far beneath the sunlit waves, in the cold, crushing pressure of the deep ocean. Here, in the twilight zone, where the weight of the water above is almost unimaginable, the steel biter has carved out its existence. In this alien realm where darkness reigns and life takes on bizarre and wonderful forms, the steel biter thrives. It shares its habitat with other strange and fascinating creatures, each adapted to the extreme conditions of the deep sea. Bioluminescent organisms light up the dark waters, creating a surreal, otherworldly landscape. Growing to lengths of over six feet and weighing in at over 500 pounds, the steel biter is a giant among fishes. Its sheer size is a testament to its dominance in this harsh environment. Few predators dare to challenge it, and those that do often find themselves outmatched. 
Its body, built for power and endurance, is encased in thick overlapping scales that resemble polished armor plating. These scales are not just for show, they serve as a formidable defense against the many dangers of the deep sea, from sharp rocks to the bites of other predators. These scales, far tougher than those of any other fish, provide the steel biter with unparalleled protection from the hazards of its deep sea home. They are a marvel of natural engineering, combining strength and flexibility in a way that allows the fish to move with surprising grace. But it is the fish's head, with its massive jaws and fearsome dentition, that truly sets it apart. These jaws are capable of exerting tremendous force, allowing the steel biter to crush the shells of even the toughest prey. Its teeth, sharp and serrated, are perfectly adapted for slicing through flesh and bone. The steel biter's skull, a marvel of biological engineering, is composed of a unique bone structure that is both incredibly strong and surprisingly lightweight. This combination of strength and lightness is essential for the fish's survival, allowing it to withstand the immense pressures of the deep while still maintaining the agility it needs to hunt. This allows the fish to withstand the immense pressures of the deep while still maintaining the agility it needs to hunt. The steel biter is a master of its domain, using its powerful body and keen senses to track down prey in the darkness. Its hunting strategy is a blend of patience and precision, waiting for the perfect moment to strike. Observing the steel biter in its natural habitat is a rare and awe-inspiring experience. It moves with a grace that belies its size, gliding through the water with effortless ease. Each movement is a testament to its evolutionary perfection, honed over millions of years to thrive in one of the most challenging environments on Earth. The deep sea is a place of wonder and mystery, and the steel biter is one of its most fascinating inhabitants. As we continue to explore the depths, we uncover more about these incredible creatures and the world they inhabit. Each discovery brings us closer to understanding the complex web of life that exists far beneath the waves. The study of the steel biter and other deep sea creatures is not just about satisfying our curiosity, it has practical implications for science and medicine, offering insights into everything from biomechanics to new materials. The resilience and adaptability of these creatures inspire innovations that could benefit humanity in countless ways. As we unveil the secrets of the steel biter, we are reminded of the vastness and mystery of the ocean. There is so much more to discover, so many more stories to tell. The deep sea remains one of the last frontiers of exploration, a place where the unknown still reigns supreme. And so the steel biter swims on, a symbol of the enduring mystery and wonder of the deep sea. Its story is far from over and as we continue to explore, we can only imagine what other marvels await us in the depths. A shell-crushing bite, the mechanics of extreme force. The steel biter's jaws are a testament to the power of natural selection. Over millions of years these jaws have evolved to become one of the most formidable tools in the animal kingdom. Unlike the jaws of most fish, which are designed for speed and agility, the steel biter's jaws are built for brute force. This distinction is crucial for its survival, as it allows the steel biter to access food sources that other fish cannot. The muscles that control these jaws are massive, anchored to the fish's skull by thick tendons. These muscles are not just large, they are incredibly efficient, converting energy into force with minimal loss. When these muscles contract, they generate a bite force that is among the most powerful in the animal kingdom. This force is not just a product of muscle size, but also of the unique way these muscles are arranged and attached. But the true secret to the steel biter's bone-crushing bite lies in its teeth. These teeth are marvels of natural engineering, designed to withstand and exert immense pressure. These are not the sharp, pointed teeth of a shark or barracuda, designed to tear and slice flesh. Instead, they are built for a different purpose altogether. Instead, the steel biter's teeth are short, blunt, and incredibly dense. This design allows them to focus the force of the bite onto a small area, maximizing the pressure exerted. Each tooth is composed of a unique mineral structure that is harder than steel. This mineral composition not only makes the teeth incredibly strong, but also highly resistant to wear and tear. When the steel biter bites down, the pressure generated by its jaws is focused on the tips of these teeth. This focused pressure is what allows the steel biter to break through the hard shells and bones of its prey. This creates an immense amount of force, enough to shatter bone, crush shells and even dent metal. The steel biter's bite is not just powerful, it is precise, delivering force exactly where it is needed. It is this incredible bite force that gives the steel biter its name, and allows it to prey on some of the most heavily armored creatures in the deep sea. 
These creatures, which would be safe from most predators, are no match for the Steel Biter's formidable jaws. The Steel Biter's environment is as challenging as its prey. Navigating through rocky crevices and dense underwater vegetation, the Steel Biter relies on its powerful jaws not just for feeding but also for defense and territorial disputes. In addition to its powerful bite, the Steel Biter is equipped with highly developed sensory organs. These organs help it detect the slightest movements and vibrations in the water, allowing it to locate prey with pinpoint accuracy. Territorial disputes are common in the Steel Biter's world. When two Steel Biters clash, their powerful jaws become their primary weapons, capable of inflicting serious damage on each other. During these disputes, the Steel Biter's jaw muscles contract with incredible speed and force, delivering bites that can deter even the most determined rival. Ultimately, the Steel Biter's powerful jaws and teeth are its greatest assets, ensuring its survival in a harsh and competitive environment. Whether crushing the shells of its prey or defending its territory, the Steel Biter's bite is a force to be reckoned with. The Steel Biter is a true marvel of evolution, a testament to the power of natural selection and the incredible adaptations that arise in the quest for survival. Its bite is not just a tool, but a symbol of its dominance in the underwater world. Masters of the Deep Reefs, Navigating a Hidden World The Steel Biter makes its home in the Deep Sea Reefs, a world of towering coral formations, sponge gardens, and sheer rock walls that plunge into the abyss. This is a realm of perpetual twilight, where sunlight fades into an inky blackness and the only illumination comes from the bioluminescent glow of strange and wonderful creatures. Navigating this challenging environment requires a unique set of adaptations. The Steel Biter, like many deep-sea creatures, has evolved large, highly sensitive eyes that are perfectly adapted to seeing in low-light conditions. These eyes, combined with a keen sense of smell and a network of pressure-sensitive organs along its flanks, allow the Steel Biter to navigate the darkness, detect prey, and avoid predators. These deep-sea reefs, while seemingly barren at first glance, are teeming with life. They are home to a bewildering array of invertebrates including crabs, lobsters, sea urchins, and mollusks, many of which are encased in thick shells or carapaces for protection. It is these armored creatures that form the staple diet of the steel biter.